<clears throat> anyway, so yeah, I've been doing this, that, or the other thing. But actually, a lot of, um, well, one thing in particular. And it kind of got me wondering when I was looking at it. I was like, my God, I haven't done like, I don't know, moves or combats or whatever. And I wonder sometimes if people um, or certain people would, you know, think, Christ, is he like actually, like, am I actually playing a game? Or, well, for me, I am. But it's maybe... Is it a game or what, like, do you, do you see what I mean? Like, I mean, um, like define game in a sense, like, uh, like what am I doing now? And, uh, like, I, I'll show you what I've been doing for several hours. And I just been, that to me has just been absolutely 100% enjoyable. Um, like just, oh my God, like it, it endorphins like there's no flipping tomorrow um and i was thinking about it um actually uh when i was listening to um well a few days afterwards uh one of uh lol snake's um mixes she actually uh uh pops in a bit of um some of the um some clips or audio clips from the never ending story i was like yes yes i freaking love that uh film Okay, hold on. I'll show you what I've been up to for, well, most of my free time. Except, I will say this on a side note. Oh, thank God I rem remembered because I probably wouldn't. Because tomorrow, July 1st and whatnot and the Battle of the Somme and all that. I uh, was going to go and watch uh, my the docu-movie that I enjoy watching. Um, and it would have been like number four for Christ's sake. So I was like, oh, you know, try to like switch it up a little bit. Anyways, this... I put it on my community tab link and there's, I've watched about half of it now. Um, and it's, uh, like restored footage, I guess, of the original British, I think it was done by some Dutch company or something or whatever, but uh, I have to find this all out. <clears throat> Anyways, holy smokes. Okay. If you're into, well, I'm sure you are, uh, into all kinds of different forms of artillery exploding and, uh, like the, the guns that are used, there was one that was each shell, was 1400 pounds i'm like what the hell and that was like it was weird because that was the well the heaviest they showed me i think it was they were called grandmothers or something like this um oh and, and there was also these plum puddings you should they're pretty freaking big man uh like almost like the size of a bowling ball um but there was these other artillery bits and i was like holy crap those are huge and it wasn't even, we haven't got to that point yet. And I was like, oh my God. All I got to say is, you want to see some proper footage of what a front looked like. Like the distance um, and the artillery shooting. And this is not Hollywood. This is real, um, the real stuff. Even though it was Hollywoodized, if you want to think. Like I'm sure, like they edited the living Dickens. Like they didn't show you this sucks, you know, or like people dying like that. I mean, you see people dying, but you, you get the idea. Um, okay. I'll show you what I've been up to. And that's why I get back to this. Like, is it, well, for me, it is a game. It's just, it's, I think it's what I'm trying to do is it's going to be my version of the never ending story as far as I'm concerned, because <laughs> yeah, it won't be a very long never ending story because I'll, you know, I'm not, I'm not going to be living, you know, for ages. So here you go. All right. Yes, I've been doing this, man. Just and some of the uh, the the information is repetitive, but not in the same order or format, if that makes any sense. So what I've been doing is the Austro-Hungarians now are adopting a two-core system, which means each army can only have a maximum of two core. Uh, so uh, which means two core HQs. That's why I'm doing it. So that's how I've converted it. So if there's somebody, for example, that has core HQ5, well, guess what? You've got the fifth core. That's the way it works now. And I know it's probably not the proper uh, ranking. It just sounded cool for my brain, which is, uh, uh, where are we here? Look, this, this is uh, the general orders. And yet again, I wanted to keep things clear. Not ambiguous. I think, th wasn't there something with Robert E. Lee or something about Gettysburg and whatnot that some people could interpret as orders? I don't want any of that crap with my stuff. So it's going to be, uh, for example, um, here's the, well, here we go. Third Army. 
take the Boog River Bridge. You figure it out. I'll try to get you the supplies and the troops and whatnot. But uh, I'll leave you alone. Like, I'm not going to micromanage you, man. Same thing with Second Army over here. Take Stanislav. Off you go. I don't know what you get, how you're going to do it. Just do it. Uh, Fourth Army, secure the border railway. I'll show you where they are. Um, First Army, secure the border north of the sand. Yet again. I'm not going to tell you how to do it. Do it. Um, I'll try to help you out as much as I can, obviously. So anyways, there we go. I figure, And I've converted all the core HQs. Uh, or make, you know, uh, found, yeah, I called them uh, general majors, I think is, it's a ranking, I think it was much lower than what you would actually be doing for a core, but tough, I like the sound of it, so there we go, so everybody, yeah, this is what I've been doing, and then, I'm. It, you know what also it's been great for, it's been chopping things down for me, it's like the old, ver uh, it's almost like my version of what dad versus son told me about with the Gorlitza, uh, Tarnif breakthrough thing when I was going to do it with Ken. Um, and I was just like, holy cow, this is too much for me. My I'm, my mind is melting. I, um, this is breaking things down for me. Look, trust me, none of this uh, is necessary to play the game. But am I, like, I'm not, you know what I mean? I'm doing something else now. I'm doing my own thing. I'm happier than hell. You've no, no flipping clue. Uh, it's just because it lets me go off into figuring out, like, who is this general major, whoever, and so on and so forth. And, it, you know, like, little, 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 off I go. Oh, just love it, man. Just flipping love it. So, and this is just the Austro-Hungarian bit here, for Christ's sakes. So I'll show you what um, is going to happen here. I'll switch hands. Hold on. Yeah, these mobile phones are heavy. Cheapers jumping. Like, my uh, 3DS doesn't feel as heavy as this, and it's, like, can do a heck of a lot more than it, what I think this can do. Well, it can it can do 3D. <laughs> All right, so here we go for First Army. Here. I just told you what to do. Se secure the border north of the sand. <laughs> you figure it out. I, I'm serious. That's it. Off you go. Second Army. Take Stanislaw. Third Army. Take the Boog River Bridge. Fourth Army. Secure the rail, uh, the border railway. I don't know what else to call it. I was looking up all kinds of things. I just couldn't find it. Um, like, uh, yeah, I'll, yeah, I've got to, whatever. Um, anyways, yeah, I'm going to go off and watch the remainder of uh, the Battle of the Somme. And it's just been uh, absolutely mind-boggling to see some, like, it's the proper... Okay, the guy, it's interesting. I guess he's reading out what would have been the um, the silent footage or like the text that was put on for the film or whatever back in the day. Uh, I don't know. Like I said, I'm just still learning all this stuff out. Um, so a big, big, big chunks of it is just silent. And it reminds me of watching the U.S. Um, uh, archives footage, which U.S. Army archives footage or whatever. It, which is just absolutely, I just love it. I mean, you know, I mean, I have to remind myself, like, the same as this stuff. And I was kind of a bit bummed out, actually, last night. I was watching some stuff on um, the taking of the Hindenburg line. Oh, my God. Uh, and, um, you know, I had to remember remind myself. They were like, and look how good we were. And, you know, I was just like, okay, you know, take it with a grain of salt, that type of text stuff. At least I'm not getting the narration of like, you know, someone like the way I would say it, as I just did a little while ago. So, yeah. The other thing, like I said, I'm going to do decking out. Yeah, I'm going to ramble on here for a bit, so I should shut up. Is, um, yeah, I'm going to start putting on properly. I'm going to make, I'm going to frame it out for the same size as a hex. And then I'll start putting pictures up, uh, personalities for the game and so on and so forth. Anything that makes sense. And, uh. I'm going to, I have to go and do a walk-in appointment is I, I just can't do it over the phone because they have to actually, you know, talk to you. It's like a consultation, but, um, and there's only one place I go to to get tattoos. So, um, I'm going to go and get another tattoo and it's going to be related to this. That's all I got to say. Okie dokie. Hope you have a great time. See ya.